what's going on, Cardinal, Cardinal Nation? Well, disappointing game today. We lose in this one, eight to four to the Cincinnati Reds in the second of three, and this game was sort of the opposite of Friday night's game, where Cardinals would have Cardinals had a big lead, and then the Reds would make it interesting, and this was, yeah, pretty much the opposite. The Reds had a, took a big week, and then we would make an attempt to rally and come back, but it came short. So, the Reds would take a 3 0 lead in the top of the second with one swing, a three-run bases-clearing double by catcher Luke Maley. That was with the bases loaded, so three runs would score, and it was also with two outs. So that would make it a three to nothing Reds lead, and they would then go up four to nothing. And at the top of the third, the rookie and top prospect in baseball, Ellie De La Cruz, with an RBI single to make it four to nothing. And then Spencer Steer a sag fly to open them up five nothing. And so Miles Mike was. Uh, they would have a scoreless fourth inning. The Reds would spend two runners. And we had a chance to get on the board in the fourth. But Jordan Walker would run into a double play. And uh, Michaelis would get out of the fifth inning. Uh, and with that, but then the Cardinals would strand two more runners in the bottom of the fifth. And so Michaelis would get through six innings, giving up five runs, but he did not, his, we did not give him any run, unfortunately, uh, as he gave up five runs, seven hits, walked two, struck out two, as he was, before the start, was on a roll, doing excellent, uh, of course, uh, two starts ago, win, eight scoreless innings, and yeah, Reds rookie in this game, Andrew Abbott, in just his second career start, would go five and a third scoreless innings, and uh, well, now in just two starts in his major league career, uh, he has uh, started out his career eleven and two thirds scoreless innings, uh, in which he. Uh, had a scoreless out in his first start against Milwaukee, and yeah, so he's off to a great start, albeit it's just two games in, but still, that's pretty impressive. So, Reds would then go up 7 to nothing, and the top of the seventh, Spencer Steer, RBI, two-run double off of Drew Verhagen. So that would make it a 7 to nothing game. Cardinals then got on the board in the bottom of the seventh. Paul Goldschmidt, RBI double. And then, the rookie, Luke and Baker, with a leadoff hit in the bottom of the eighth. This was his first start at home as in the majors. And then, next batter, Dylan Carlson, a two-run home run. Carlson just activated off the IL uh, as he coming off the IL with a uh, a I think an ankle injury and his first start and appearance in uh, over almost a month. Uh, he actually started last night's game, but just forgot to mention that he was off the IL. So a two run home run for Dylan. That would make it a 7 to 3 game. And that was his third home run of the season. So just like that, it would be 7 3. Uh, and then Jordan Walker with the double. Brandon Donovan would walk. And Nolan Gorman pinch hitting for uh, Andrew Kisner. But he would pop out Tommy Edmund, but then fly out to end the inning. Then Yasis Cabrera would come in to pitch in the ninth. And Tyler Stevenson with an RBI, double, RBI single rather to make it an 8 3 game. And then in the bottom of the ninth, Nolan Arenado 
a solo home run, second straight night with a home run. Stout cut the lead at 8 4. And then down to our final level, Dylan Carlson with the walk. Uh, so our comeback come falls short. And yeah, so now uh, hopefully we can win the series Sunday. Uh, Adam Wainwright gets a start. Uh, and for the Reds, their starter is a flamethrower, Hunter Green, who has 88 strikeouts already, and yeah, he's a very good young pitcher, so see what happens Sunday, comments per se, go cards.